call the meeting to order. Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge, pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. To our special meeting here. And the new business item is amend the management agreement with the new healthcare management. So, Pat, probably you're probably the best place to start off with with uh, okay. what we're seeing and and uh, explanations and such. Well, the uh, <clears throat> this has changed a little bit from what you saw uh, yesterday. Um, very little, but these based upon comments that were made by the news council. Um, and we can go through those if there are questions about the specifics, but largely they were uh, semantics and uh, had one misspelling. I think corrected it. A couple members changed the name of it from being an amended agreement to being a restated agreement, which is because we're retyping the whole thing. I, that's a, a very small change. Um, and but but uh, the gist of the restated agreement is that uh, a new will take on serve take on the uh, the obligations of being the administrator, the business office manager, and the MDS coordinator for the facility, which are three important important uh, functions up there. Um, in exchange for that, there will be an increase in the monthly, the base monthly management fee, which will go from $5,000 uh, at, at present to $12,000 per month. And also there's a, a possibility of a, of a quarterly bonus based upon, uh, based upon any, uh, surplus if there's an operating surplus for the quarter and surplus is what you would call profit if you were talking about a for-profit entity but this is not a for-profit entity um, and that's a switch away from the prior versions had to do with uh, had it based upon just simply revenue and revenue by itself um, doesn't take into you can still lose money and even a lot of money and have substantial revenues. So I think that's a, a, one of the things that that we have wanted for the county out of the agreement. And the the operating um, uh, surplus in, conceptually we're dividing it in two. But, one half of it is the counties and the other half is subject to uh, a new being able to earn it, providing that they have, that they meet the, uh, the benchmarks that are set forth in the contract. Um, so uh, there was very, there are very few changes that were made from the draft that you saw yesterday. I sent out a red line version of it. Um, but it's, uh, it looks acceptable to, to me. Okay, so one of the, like the big movements is the uh, administrator is now going to be in a new uh, employee and not the county employee, correct? It is correct, yes. And so we are paying them a fee, but they are paying the salary of the new administrator plus the other two positions. That, that is correct. So, I mean, if... I mean, it it kind of looks like a big fee, but when you get look at what we're getting, what we're I'm taking away from our responsibility, it's it's just kind of a switch over instead of a just a new cost in addition to. So, is that a right way of phrasing that? Yeah, and I would also kind of piggyback on that to say that we're putting three critical positions in a news uh, wheelhouse. Uh, to become successful. Okay. 
Any other comments on that? Is a new on today? I don't see them yet, no. <clears throat> Do we need any other analysis or Jack, do you have any comments? Well, I, I read the agreement and it sounds exactly what we've been asking for. Um, I'm pretty comfortable with the way it's presented. Um, it's all up to them to make some of this stuff work. So the uh, monkey's on their back, not on my back. So it's out of here is either Twister Quinn or Richard Knoll, they need to take responsibility to get it done, which I think they'll do under this new term of contract. Yeah, I was felt much better after our discussion yesterday with the new, um, the direction that this was taking. So um, after having those discussions, how this actually works and trickles down. So. Well, and I think um, being present for the all staff meeting um, when we basically roundtabled with everyone that works there um, to explain the struggles um, that we faced um, and the path that we were taking um, and we got buy in and um, I think this will really build the team uh, that we need to up there on, on both sides of the um, of the facility from leadership and management to um, the ones putting in the hours and busting their tails. Um, because I know it's interesting for someone ha having no experience in long-term care um, and what I've learned in the year and a half and to see the struggles of the people actually doing the job that come down from the schedules or the administrator or the lack of um, leadership, um, so to speak, in different areas that I think that partnering us together with a news track record um, and also feeling good from hearing from Atchison residents what they've done at the Nortonville facility um, and how that one has, you know, been turned around that I'm just hopeful. I'm hopeful. Um, I love the communication that we've had from our staff um, and our residents. I love that we have resident family members here today to listen um, because at the end of the day, that communication piece um, is key to knowing where we're at and how we're doing and the success. And well, I saw a saying today that reminded me of this, but it says it'll be okay in the end. If it's not okay, it's not yet the end. So we've got to let the chance for the end to be okay at this point. Okay. Anything else? Shall I call for a motion to approve the restated management agreement with a new health care? I would move to do it. I'll second that. It's been moved and seconded. Any other discussion? All in favor say aye. 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 It passes three to zero. Any need for an executive session? Is it, uh, do I hear a motion to adjourn? I'm going to adjourn at 309. I'll second yeah. It's been moved and seconded. All in favor say aye. 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 I sent you a I think you all you got an email from signrequest.com. 